Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if the quick settings are not working on Windows 11. The first solution that you should always take in consideration is to use an alternative method to open the settings app. To do this press the Windows button and then simply type settings and select it from the search results. Now you can see that this is one way to access the settings app. Another way is to simply access the settings app via the action center. To do this click on the Wi-Fi speaker and battery icon in the lower right corner and you will see that you have a small gear icon named all settings. Just click it. Now you can see that this is another way to access the settings app. You can also enable the settings app in case you don't have it enabled. To do this press the windows button and then simply type reg edit and select registry editor from the search results. In here you have to navigate to the following location. H key current user and then you have to double click software and then scroll down until you find and double click Microsoft then scroll down until you find the Windows key and double click it afterwards double click current version then find the policies key and lastly double click Explorer in case you don't have the Explorer key you can just right click policies hover over new and then select a new key which is gonna be named Explorer now in the Explorer key just right click an empty space on the right side and then hover over new and select the DWORD value. The name of the DWORD key should be no control panel. Now all you have to do is simply double click this key and then select the value data as zero and press on OK to save changes and lastly you can just restart your PC to check if the problem still persists. You can also use the local group policy editor to enable the settings application. This is what you have to do. Press the Windows button then simply type gpedit.msc and select it from the search results. In here navigate to the following location. User configuration, then double click on administrative templates and then click on control panel. On the right side select the prohibit access to control panel and PC settings and double click it. In here select the disabled checkbox and then press on apply and ok to save the changes. You can also use the SFC or DISM commands. To do this press the windows button then simply type cmd and run command prompt as an administrator. In the command prompt window type the following commands and press enter after each one. You have to note that the SFC scan and the DISM scans can take some time so don't lose patience. And after you input it and process the commands just restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. And lastly you can also reinstall your settings app. To do this press the windows button then simply type cmd and run command prompt as an administrator. In here copy paste the following command that I also put in the description below to reinstall the settings app. Now if you press enter windows will start reinstalling the settings app and then you can just restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. And that's it, plenty of solutions to consider. As usual for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.